published 1610 Eastern Standard Time, the 27th of December the 2017, updated 1759 Eastern Standard Time, the 27th of December 2017. The Premier League has become embarrassing and a joke because of the tactics of smaller clubs at home to the top six, says Jamie Carragher. Sky Sports pundit and former Liverpool defender Carragher made the extraordinary attack at half-time of Newcastle United. Against Manchester City, Newcastle were trailing 1-0 having had only two touches in the opposition box at home against Leeds City, who had 15 shots in the first 45 minutes, leading Carragher to blast the negative tactics, not just of the Magpies but of the entire Premier League bottom half. The Premier League has become embarrassing and a joke, says Jamie Carragher. Carragher launched the attack at halftime of Newcastle United against Manchester City speaking on Sky Sports. Carragher said, not just Newcastle but the Premier League in general, when they come up against the top six, certainly at home, it's becoming embarrassing. The Premier League now is becoming a bit of a joke league, with the top teams being so far ahead of the ones at the bottom. For those clubs, it's almost like they are accepting they're going to lose the game, as long as it is only 1 or 2 nil. The Premier League has been built on every team having a go. That's why everyone around the world wants to watch it. Will they keep watching if they keep seeing football like that? Carragher accepted that lower table sides such as Newcastle, managed by Rafa Benitez, who he played under when Liverpool won the 2005 Champions League, would be more defensively minded against the leading sides. In the first half Newcastle had two touches in the City box, one. A chip cleared off the line however, he feels it is compromising what was once one of the league's greatest plus points, the idea that a team could beat anyone else in the division. Carragher said, I have no problem with them sitting deep, I played under Rafa Benitez, and it's not just Newcastle, I've seen it virtually every week. There has got to be some sort of aggression, some sort of plan for winning the ball back and then going forward, it's seeing it at home. When every team came to Anfield they played like that, but at home, it's a sad state of affairs for the Premier League. Carragher said it was not just a problem of Rafa Benitez but of the whole Premier League after the game. Carragher further clarified his comments, saying that if the main aim of every Premier League team against City is just to stay in the game, the entertainment value will vanish. He said, I was scathing more of the Premier League in general rather than Newcastle, and there is no problem with sitting deep, of course you are going to do that against City, but once they go into Newcastle's half where is the aggression? City had 10 yards of space when they were 30 yards from goal, it's difficult to counter-attack against City because they are so good on the ball, and when you win it they're good at getting it back off you. It was more the aggression, letting City take two or three touches. This is at Newcastle, an intimidating place with an atmosphere. It was too easy. The main aim of every manager against Man City now is to try and stay in the game as long as possible. Newcastle are in the game, 1-0 down with 10 to go. Almost scored, 1-1 would have been a great result. It's just sad really for the Premier League if people think it is about keeping the score down. It wasn't great defending from Newcastle that meant they were still in the game, it was because Aguero forgot his shooting boots. It should have been 3 or 4 nil. Carragher was backed up by fellow pundit Gary Neville, who accused Benitez and Newcastle of showing no ambition. Newcastle's ultra-defensive tactics at home to lead a City drew the ire of Carragher instead of Benitez. He makes this Newcastle tactic look embarrassing. It has to change, there's defending, and there's showing absolutely no ambition whatsoever, if it were a boxing match, the referee would have stopped it. Hopefully it will spark them into life, to give them something to watch. Former Newcastle goalkeeper Shea Gibbon was also surprised by the approach adopted by his old club, I think even the Newcastle fans just wanted to see someone flying into a tackle even that gets them off their seats and they didn't see that, especially in the first half. Given said after the final whistle, there was definitely an improvement in the second half and Rafael Benitez, you could argue at the end they could have sneaked a draw and everyone would be saying what a fantastic result, which it would have been. In the first half for me it was too defensive, too negative, especially playing at St James Park. What will they do when they go to the Etihad, Newcastle? How will they play down there?